I try to upload a video that I made for you guys last night. It's 30 minutes, 32 minutes long. And I've been uploading it for... Bean. BB. Stop. I've been uploading for almost 24 hours. Well, 24 hours at 2 o'clock tonight. So about 17 hours. And it's still at 30-something percent. I don't know what's going on with that. So here's an update uh, what I went through. Real quick with the colonoscopy and endonoscopy, it went fine. I was scared uh, as soon as things got real, I got scared <laughs> and that's normal. Um, the performance of the doctor and all of their, their staff was amazing. Uh, everybody did great. Everybody kept reassuring me, making me feel safe and that's really important. Um, I say to each and every one of you guys, go get your colonoscopy, endonoscopy if you have to, whatever the doctor suggests. You don't feel anything. And I'm a chicken, huge chicken when it comes to um, doctors, being dentist, you name it. I'm scared of them. Always have been. My mom's the same way. Stop, guys. Um, once they put the injection... Uh, put me to sleep, took one deep breath, I was out, they did what they did, they found three pulps, they removed the, all three, uh, they did a biopsy on the three pulps, all three of those pulps are being tested. Hopefully everything goes well. Um, my tummy was tested for gas problems and stuff like that. Everything came out fine. Now I just need to find out why I have uh, like a heartache and burping and pains in my tummy. I'm on, I'm taking fiber now. I started, I started taking fiber on Wednesday. Today's Friday. And I'm on some kind of medication for my acid reflux prescri prescribed. But I'm here to tell you guys, do it. Do it. It's not as bad. It's not as bad and we need to talk about colonoscopies, endonoscopies, um, stuff that we usually don't talk about. We need to make it more normal. Say hello. She's so pretty. She's so pretty. She just loves her mom. She'll just sit there and listen to me talking. Such a beautiful baby. And there's the other one. And the other one. And then Honey's outside. I'm going to pretend I'm talking to her because she loves when I talk to her. I'm wearing this because it's darn cold today. And I'm going to go to my sister's house to drop off some soup. She has a throat infection. Drop off soup. Take her some flowers. And I'm just dropping it off. I'm not going in. She's just going to come out and grab it. I'm grateful to be back with my sister and be able to show her love and affection. And she does the same for me. So, yeah, go get it, guys. Go get your endonoscopy, colonoscopy. It's not that bad. It really isn't. It really is not that bad. Um, it's not bad at all, actually. The only pain in the butt is the drink. After, like, five cups, it starts to taste not nasty. It's just, like, you're over it like I'm over it I want I want to stop and then the pooping no cramps not for me I didn't have any cramps it didn't hurt you're just basically peeing through your butt um the whole injection and all of that none of that hurt either being put to sleep none of that hurt don't remember anything uh woke up everybody was great um had a snack nurses were great if I can get that other video up I will it was longer way longer it's 32 minutes um, then I'll put it up but for right now I've tried to delete and re-upload about seven times and it's not working um, yeah so hopefully soon in these next few weeks you guys will be seeing me arting and creating and inspiring and being back in your guys's art rooms and living rooms yeah 
So this is my new room. This used to be my daughter's room. This is my new room. And let me show it to you guys. Let's see if I can flip the camera while it's on. I don't know what this button is. Let's figure this out, ma'am. I know that you click the screen. Let me try to flip. No, okay, let me show you this way. So this is my corner. I'm still not done. I still need to put art in my on on my walls. Here's my window. Outside is my guard, half of my garden. There's my corner. Some of the art that I'm going to put up is down there. There's my suitcase. Vintage suitcase I found in the street. That puppy right there reminds me of Miko. Miko passed away and there's my little chimney and that flower right there smells up my whole room really nice and that's there's my husband's closet there's my lamp and there's pico and here's my bed so yo i need to put some art back here make it more cozy and stuff like that having my cup of joe i take that back it's not a cup of joe i'm not i'm not um that's not my saying it's cafecito i'm having my cafecito so I like my shoes i like to flip my uggs i like to have the fur down yeah, my back is feeling, um, I'm got in a, I didn't get in a car accident. A person ran me over. A person was an idiot. Um, about two years ago, and I'm still dealing with um, the aftermath of that accident. Anyways, I still I'm, have trauma walking around in parking lots, around cars. Um, I still get freaked out uh, anyways so I get to wear these with inserts very expensive inserts and that's a problem because expensive things are a problem <laughs> okay so let's see George is home this is how I see him getting home I get to see him walk right through my porch right here He's teasing the dogs. The dogs just sit there and watch him come home. I usually open the window a little bit so I can hear the cars in the air because I have my ear problem. I told him I was recording. He opens his mouth. It's silly. That's how excited he gets home. I'm laughing. He's such a good guy. <laughs> Boy, he went to go get flowers for my sister. So we could drop off soup and flowers, water, toilet paper. Of course, she's not going to come out anytime soon. I'm being nosy okay so I'm gonna wrap it up here tell you guys thank you for everything and we'll be back soon arting and creating and my dog's wondering who am I who are you talking to mom I, I I don't appreciate you talking to other strangers talk to me mom I usually go on walks with the dogs, but not today. Or maybe when I get back, but I don't think so because it's Friday and there's drunk, a lot of drunk drivers out there. I'm, I'm in Los Angeles. <laughs> not to say that that's why, but yeah, there's, a, there's still house parties and stuff like that. 
I could put a big old flower right here and I'm ready to go out. Okay, I'll talk to you guys soon and go get your endo and, and colonoscopies. All right, have any questions, let me know. Bye.